I played Immortality maybe about a week ago. I just recently completed it. And it's been sticking out in my mind for quite a few reasons. I think I just wanted to talk about why I enjoyed it so much. I was not expecting... Well, I wasn't expecting much. I, I had no idea what the game was when I saw it on Game Pass. So I was like, sure, I'll download it. Not knowing that it was developed by uh, Sam Barlow. Because I had played her story and I had played... Um, I didn't beat Telling Lies, but... I did a stream where we played like the first few hours of, of Telling Lies, and I had fun with those, but this was just on another scale. Like there's three whole movies that they had to film, and they had to film the behind the scenes portions, and then there's other things going on that I won't spoil for you if you haven't played this game, uh, and you're just trying to figure out who these people are why you should be interested and it gives you reason to be it's like okay you're, you're like oh i don't like that let's let's try to get to the bottom of this and you're just following rabbit holes the whole time um it is kind of hard to keep track of i i wish there was a, a little more in terms of a user-friendly interface to just kind of you can mark stuff, but I, I I don't know. I didn't find myself making use of that all that much. I wish there was just more groupings. But aside from that, the story was fantastic, especially considering that this is, for all intents and purposes, a, an FMV game, like a visual novel, more so than an actual... Like, all the interactiveness you're getting is, like, you're clicking on the screen to... Uh, transfer object to object between scenes you know that's pretty much what you're doing that and you're you're scrubbing back and forth through footage and the mechanic they had in play there was really fantastic in terms of uh things you could do with horror using that element they really nailed something there all the per like well there was some real standout performances I don't, I don't know if I want this to be a spoiler review, though. I don't, I don't know if I want to be giving away characters. Because you kind of... It's kind of like the... Uh, part of what's fun with the game is you're like, Oh, who's that? And you start clicking on them. You start like, okay, that's who this person is. Um, I don't know if I want to give that away. I, If you haven't played this game, I really recommend... That you go in without knowing, um, without knowing too much about the plot. I think there's a lot of satisfaction to be had in uncovering this mystery on your own. But in terms of an FMV game, I've never played one this good. Her story was great, and telling lies, from what I can gather, was pretty good too. But yeah, this is just on another level. Very, very ambitious, and I'm, I'm actually quite surprised that they were able to pull off so much um and film so much i think there's 20 hours of footage filmed for this but yeah i'm just excited to see what they come out with next so i would give this game like yeah probably in the eight maybe the nine range just because the story stuck with me so much i really enjoyed the uh all the twists and turns and how unpredictable it could get. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching this and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you want more reviews or content like this. So take it easy and have a good one.